Hi, my name is Richard Tibbetts. I'm a first-year medical student here at UMass. And uh, I was asked to say something about LPP, which is Longitudinal Preceptor Program. And it's a program that uh, enables us to get clinical experience uh, uh, over the course of our studies. It's composed of about seven sessions, and each session lasts about three hours. And we go out and spend uh, three hours with the doctor in the clinical environment, uh, interviewing and talking with real patients. Um, it's a program that I knew nothing about before I came to school, and uh, it's turned out to be one of my favorite things about uh, UMass. Um, after you've had your head in a book all week and sitting in lecture hall, it just gives you a chance to get out and um, talk to real patients, um, interview them, and see things that you're actually studying. Um, I remember uh, after one class where we were talking about hernias, inguinal hernias, that very afternoon somebody came in and presented with an inguinal hernia. So you really get sort of a hands-on appreciation for what you're learning in class and studying in lecture hall. It's a great program. Thank all right. Hey guys, what's up? My name's Andrew. I'm a first year med student here. And I'm, uh, I'm going to hear you talk about the, the community health clerkships that we do. We do it in our first year in October after our second round of exams. We get a nice two week break and you can sign up, you can choose sort of what you want to do as far as medicine that helps the community and looks at sort of a broad based form of medicine. So people worked with um, drug, drug addicts, the elderly, underserved populations, and I did a really uh, unique and fun rotation in the prison system in Massachusetts. And UMass has a unique relationship with the prison system because uh, we provide all the doctors for the state prisons, which no other med school does um, in Massachusetts. So I had the opportunity to go around, we toured all the different facilities, the women's, the men's, uh, the high security, the low security, the drug rehab centers, and we worked with the doctors there. We spent some time shadowing. We spent some time just sort of touring and seeing sort of what prison life is like, what it's like being a care provider for that population, uh, and it was fascinating. And it's a it's a really good break from the schoolwork that we do, and it comes it comes early on into our experience too. And I know that um, there's really a, a wealth of choices that you have to do. Mine was just one of them, and people I think for the most part, really loved what they did for their CHC. Um, and it's a, it's a great experience, it's a great part of med school. Alexis, big second year on campus. <laughs> Tell me, what's something that makes UMass unique? I think UMass is really unique because um, it's not focused on working in classes all the time and um, focused on spending all of your time in the library or poring over your Netter anatomy books. Um, most people do a variety of extracurricular activities, um, things uh, ranging from elective classes such as wilderness medicine, history of medicine, alternative medicine, adoption, um, teen pregnancy, public health. There is just a huge uh, range of um, elective classes that you can take. Um, and there are also a variety of other um, clubs and, and interest groups. Um, there is usually an interest group for each medical specialty that you could go into. So if you'd like opportunities to meet with doctors and residents and learn more about their specialties, there are tons of um, events in those, with those um, interest groups. And then there's just sort of a handful of other uh, random things that you could get involved in, such as the Seven Hills Symphony Orchestra, which is a ton of fun and a great break from studying. Um, let's see, what else is there? People play um, like club sports together. Um, there's just there's such a, a great range of things going on here, and it makes life really enjoyable, even when you're in med school. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay, so Jay Ferguson, what makes UMass great? Uh, what makes UMass great uh, is a combination of the students who are selected here, um, the atmosphere of camaraderie. Uh, they're not, we spend a lot of time in the library here, but it's a great environment, um, a lot of fun. I've lived here for 20 plus years and uh, I've loved every minute of it. Uh, you come find me, ask, answer any questions you have. <laughs> <laughs>